When it comes to customizing your status bar, as we talked about in the first training video, it's down here at the bottom of the window. It contains the stats of your uh, Word document, like what page you're on, how many words you have in your document, and a few other things you can hover over, any proofing errors or using macros, and you've got some other features over here. But to customize it, just right click on it, and then come up here and go ahead, and those that are checked are the ones that are added to the stat bar. And if you want to go ahead and get rid of it, like I said in the first training video, just go ahead and uncheck it. And the reason why I'm covering this again, because if you didn't watch the first training video, but you're looking for keywords like, hmm, I want to learn how to customize my status bar, you wouldn't know anything about that if you didn't watch the first training video. So at least you can look for the keyword here and pull up this video. And you can see down below that it's gone. Let me go ahead and check it. It adds a back page. You can do a line number. And it says I'm on the first line. When I click off in a blank area, it disappears. So when I hit the Enter key on the keyboard, you can see that it updates and takes me to line 2. Hit Enter, it goes to line 3, and so on. I'm going to hit the Backspace key on my keyboard a couple of times so I can go back up to line 1, and it deletes the Backspace key, anything that's behind the cursor. The Delete key deletes anything that's in front of the cursor. And we'll go over that just a little bit more when we start creating our documents. So again, when you're typing your document and you want to find out the stats of the document, what page you're on, if you add the uh, line feature to the status bar, then what line you're on, how many words, in any case, you can customize this. So I'm going to get rid of the line number here, and you can look over the others and see if it's something you want to keep uh, track of. And then click off in a blank area, and the menu disappears. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel to get notified of the latest videos. And for great specials on my products, please see the description below this video.